So I've been using this for a few years now. This is the, you know, the less than $10 Sentec float charger from Harbor Freight. This is actually my second unit. The first one <laughs> disconnected right about here. So I don't know if the wire got pinched. Using it for several years, it's been pretty well. There's some corrosion, but honestly, I believe that's from my battery, not from the clamp itself. The wires are a bit thin, but you know, it does work really well. It has a charging light. It's great for my car because I really don't drive it that often, which I'll probably go over in another, yeah. another video. But it definitely does a job. Never had an issue starting the car again. So, yeah, there's some people cutting trees outside, so that's a, probably the chainsaw noises you hear in the background. <laughs> so, yeah, those float chargers would really work well for something like a riding mower if you're storing these batteries in the winter. Or even if you're not cutting the grass that often, like in my case, these things lose a lot of charge each week enough for it to actually not start the mower. Uh, the batteries are a lot tinier. So yeah, this is a good situation where I know a lot of people have used these float chargers. So when things get really dead uh, or drained, I still have to use a, a full battery charger going back to that lawnmower battery i don't believe that the trickle chargers or maintainers are meant to charge a completely dead battery so i still have this thing but you can see how much larger it is so two different uses but it is still nice to have a larger unit around for those uh, situations <laughs> 